normally led by Grayson Allen, the preseason player of the year. Today, he stands at the back of the pack, serving the first game of an indefinite suspension. And I believe Seth Allen has never played an NCAA tournament throughout his time at Maryland or here. But Justin Robinson continues his stellar play, knocking down the three in the corner. And they've done it through their second chance points, 9-0 advantage. And they continue to attack the paint as Seth Allen finds his way to the rim and finishes. And the advantage still 11. Bibbs wants it again for three. Swirls it around. The Hokies are red hot. And how much better he had gotten. So no surprise to see him coming out and having such a great start to this season. Hill breaks away and jams. Without Luke Kennard, this would be a very different game for Duke right now. Kennard double team with five. He's got to get rid of it. Defense waiting. Rejection. Shot clock violation against the Blue Devils. Jefferson with a size advantage and the drop off for Tatum. You know, we talked a lot about Grayson Allen in the first half. With another bucket for Hill. The transition for Virginia Tech. We can't even speak, Mike. They're running so fast. 15 to shoot. And Kennard, for the first time today, connects from three. Justin Bibbs is playing, and he has responded big time here to start off ACC play. Bibbs comes up with a steal. He's got Jackson on his heels. When you got him on skates, you got to keep rolling. We're right in front of them. They answered the call, and they'll do it again. Allen the lob, and Brock with the exclamation. And they have been chomping at the bit to get to this point to show everyone that the Hokies are for real, and they passed the test with flying colors here this afternoon.